The acolyte Sith Lord, Kimmer slash The Stranger, shockingly broke a Star Wars record that even Emperor Palpatine slash Darth Sidious himself didn't beat. The acolyte faced considerable backlash, which came to a head with the acolyte's cancellation. However, even among those who didn't like the acolyte, Kimmer slash The Stranger was generally a well-liked character. In part, The Stranger's introduction was thrilling because he represented the first new Sith in Star Wars movies and TV shows in quite some time. Even beyond the novelty, though, Kimmer proved to be an exceptional Sith Lord, as he was a perfect balance of powerful, terrifying, and compelling. In fact, it was partially Kimmer's truly chilling nature that led to him breaking this one surprising Star Wars record. Kimmer killed more Jedi on screen than anyone else. Kimmer slash the Stranger proved to be terrifying throughout the Acolyte, but the most brutal episode in terms of Kimmer's strength and violence was the Acolyte Episode 5. It was in that episode that Kimmer went on his massive Jedi killing spree, killing five Jedi on screen and still more off screen. This included stabbing Jedi Padawan Jackie Lon multiple times and then referring to her as it after she died and snapping Yord Fander's neck. Kimmer also pulled one Jedi onto his lightsaber after already having one Jedi pierced on the blade. Truly, this was a major bloodbath in Star Wars history. More than just a particularly violent episode, though, this episode of the Acolyte broke a Star Wars record. Specifically, in the Acolyte Episode 5, Kimmer killed more Jedi on screen than any other Sith has. Although Palpatine and Vader both give Kimmer a run for his money, neither beats Kimmer's kill count. Palpatine kills for Jedi in his office in Star Wars, Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith and orchestrates the murder of countless Jedi through Order 66, but he does not personally carry out those kills. Likewise, Vader kills many Jedi during Order 66, but those kills, including his slaughter of the younglings, primarily happen off-screen. Even Darth Maul, who proved to be absolutely vicious in Star Wars, the Clone Wars in particular, killed many, but most of them were non-Jedi. Undoubtedly, these Sith ultimately killed many more people than Kimmer did, but, in terms of on-screen kills of Jedi, Kimmer had the most. Kimmer's record sets the scene for Palpatine while Kimmer might have shown off his brute force in the Acolyte, though, few could rival Palpatine's brilliance. In fact, not only did Palpatine take down the Jedi Order and the Republic simultaneously, but he also managed to have others carry out his dirty work. Specifically, through his Order 66 plot, Palpatine ensured that he didn't need to get his hands dirty to bring an end to the Jedi, he had a clone army that did it all for him. I in fact, in terms of Star Wars' most successful Sith, there really is very little contest. Palpatine managed to manipulate everyone around him to achieve his aims, and he took down the incredible Darth Plagueis single-handedly. Nevertheless, in terms of on-screen Jedi kills, shockingly, the Acolyte's Kimmer slash the Stranger was the Sith to break the record.